Oh, hello. I almost didn't see you there, frolicking amongst the ferns. Are you lost? Wandering alone? Or did you come here looking for me? Either way, you're with me now. Welcome to my enchanted forest. Doesn't look like a forest, you say? Well, that simply isn't true. Can't you see the tall, dark trees as their branches bend towards you? Don't you smell the pine trees on the breeze and feel the crisp autumn air? Can you not hear the song of the owl and the nightingale? And do you not see me beside you? Feel my hot breath as I reach my hand towards you. Tonight, we have an evening's entertainment prepared for you that is so exciting, it will stop your heart. A special, mysterious, and miraculous performance just for you. We have been waiting for you. This evening, you will see wonders, beauty, magic, manipulation, betrayal, deception, and death. Oh, don't be scared. I'll be with you the whole time. Don't stray from the path. Be careful who you befriend. And above all else, you will never know what power you possess until you face your fears. Let's begin. Once on a dark forest path, three travelers were going down an unfamiliar road. They were led by a leader who boasted that they had no vice. Let's, Let's go, go this way. way. It, it will be faster and we will waste less time. time. Should we stay on the path? I heard no good things come to those who wander. Nonsense. I'm the leader. I know what's right. So off they went, one by one. Little did they know fairies were watching with glee, knowing they could torture these mortals that be. A fairy approached the first traveler. Why don't you follow me? I know a quiet place to lay your head. You, you must be very tired. tired. Thank you, that would be lovely. After walking for what felt like miles, the traveler arrived at a beautiful lake with hammocks beside it. He thanked the fairy wholeheartedly and fell into a deep sleep. That was way too easy. These mortals are so inferior. Now this is where the real fun begins. Sonium ad sonum. way is north. We can try to navigate by the stars. Not if the sky is shroud covered in these dark clouds.
hearing the cries of the little one, the leader rushed toward the boys. You have found us. Good for you. But if you wish to go free, you must pay a fee. Answer our riddle. Then we will let you be. Tell me quickly, I will answer. For it's I waited till night. I neglected everything right. While filling my view, there's nothing much to do. For more of it lessens your sight. What is it? The answer is stars, clear as day. Aha! You have riddled poorly. Arrogance always leaves you bare. Now you shall feast upon your dreams until you are no more. Wait! Don't hurt him! The answer's darkness! Alas! The sport is done! Lucky for you that you had this little one with you on your journey. Now you are free to continue on your path. Be gone! Be gone! Boy! And so, the three travelers were once more on their path. The fair folk, for all their sport, left them to their journey. Let yourself not forget, the oldest is not always the wisest, and the young hold the key to the future. Wasn't that lovely? A little fable, a moral, to make us all feel better about the horrible turmoil we watch these characters suffer. Or did you not enjoy yourself? Well, this should make you feel better. After all, it is a dance, and dancing with me is always a hell of a good time. Come with me. In den Abend wir steigen heute Nacht in Zauberweisen, wildes Volk und Lilith's Art, lauernd Winde heimlich wahr. Lasst uns zu den Feuerstreifen raunen nach den Sternen, greifen Gutes und auch Böses vor. Now it is your turn to come and dance with me. Whatever is the matter, there is no need to be frightened. Don't you want to be as free as the fairies? As brave as a little traveler? What do you want your story to be? You can trust me.
magic after all. We all are. Don't you know we all carry a little bit of magic within ourselves? We use it every day when we conjure someone in our thoughts, when you bind your heart to another in a bond of love, when you damn someone's immortal soul to the deepest depths of hell. Oh, no one else does that. Just me. Well, you have magic in any right. Now. That magic you have can either be used for good or evil. Most people believe they use it for good. I know what I use it for. I think you know what I use it for too. You know what I want. I could give you what you want too. You know where to find me. 